Hey guys, welcome back to the channels, plural, it is moi, your inner chakras and the Pisces channel. Guys, it's like 4 in the morning, I think, I think I woke up around 3, 3.30, well actually I've been waking up almost every hour, only an hour. And usually when it's like that, it's either somebody's either in my energy space or there's something, so spirits say get up. So I'm just going to do a reading real quick, and then... Go back to bed. I'll try to anyway. Holy Spirit, but something woke me up, right? Why am I up, Spirit? And why do I decide to do a reading, Spirit? Why am I up? Why am I doing a reading? Why? Is there a message here? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, for the collective. Guys, I'm doing this for both channels, so this is for everybody. If your energies are here, your energies are here. If they're not here, don't force it, guys, right? Okay, let me go. I just flip it. These are just so thick cards, that's all. All right, Spirit, what is going on? Why am I up? What do I need to see? Or share. Right. It cleanses the energy, guys. It grounds it. All right, here we go. The star in reverse. No wonder I can't sleep. <clears throat> so somebody here isn't very hopeful. I think about this connection. They're not very hopeful at all. They're up at night, which means they got me up. Somebody's energy, somebody's collective energy got me up. Probably because they watched the channel. I don't know. But they're up at 2, 3, 4, 5, 1 30. I'm getting chills in the morning can't sleep thinking about you it's like they're feel like they feel like they're running out of hope they're running out of hope they can't sleep they're having nightmares it's, they just can't do it because they're carrying around a lot of burdens this person's carrying a lot of burdens and i know it isn't me because i don't have any burdens right now so this message is definitely for my collective. It could be somebody that you're connected to. But this person is dealing with a lot of, they're dealing with something. They're not very hopeful. Holy Spirit, clarify this star card in reverse. What is wrong? Why aren't they hopeful? Because they don't want to be left out in the cold anymore. They feel left out in the cold. <clears throat> yep. They feel like you ended whatever connection that was going on. It's the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. They feel that it's over. They feel like, I don't know if you had a family together, kids, family, dog, but it's the Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Someone could feel like they in a doghouse, right? Left out in the cold in the doghouse carrying too many burdens. Yep. And what it is, is they secrets were revealed. Somebody's going to lose all hope because whatever they were doing, whatever they was doing, got them kicked the fuck out of their ten of pentacles. They secrets, they dirty little secrets were revealed. Mmm. Okay, so the dirty little secrets were revealed. What do I need? Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, why is this person in their nine of swords energy? Why can't they sleep? Like what is on their mind? Mm. They was out celebrating. They was out dipping in and doing it with someone else. Three of cup and it with someone else. Either that or they think you out celebrating with someone else and they can't sleep. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, why can't this person sleep? Why are they up in their head? 
Oh, they think you don't love them no more. They don't think you love them anymore. King of Cups in reverse. They think you pulled your love back. Tell us about this King of Cups in reverse spirit. Why do they feel that way? Well, they, right? That could be you. Yep. Yeah. They feel like <clears throat> your ships are coming in elsewhere, right? They feel like you're waiting on something else to come in. Like they feel like you don't love them anymore and that you're celebrating. Wait a minute. My, uh, my sage is really strong. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Burn behind me, honey. Lord. I'm burning no more. I'm just strong as hell. What the hell? See, that's why I don't need to be up this early. I don't have time for this shit. Does somebody think you turned your back on them? That you wait on that you waiting on brighter days. You're waiting for your ships to come in. Shit, right? You're waiting on your ships to come in. Alright, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. So they think you love. Holy Spirit, tell us about these burdens. Back to the tower. They could have made a wrong choice, guys. They chose somebody. They could have chose somebody over you. Maybe you found out and you just turned your back on them. Yep. You could have found out they was in a connection. Or ending a connection. Yep. They were ending a connection with the child's mom, mother, like mother or something. They were they're they're in a connection. So you you found out their dirty little secrets. <clears throat> it probably came to you in a dream. That's probably why I'm up. Mm hmm You found out their dirty little secrets. So now they can't sleep because you don't turn your back on them. Holy Spirit, tell me why this person. Mm -hmm. What are some of these dirty little secrets? This person feels powerless. That's why they can't sleep at night. That's why they up at night. They feel powerless. Confessions. This person, they want to confess to you. They want to confess. They want to clear the air. Because they know you know. You know about this other person. Look at this. They want to clear the air. They have guilt collective. They're dealing with guilt. Your person's dealing with guilt. Your person's dealing with guilt. So they have a person. Where am I trying to go with this? Where's my big cards? Mm -hmm. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. They feel powerless. Holy Spirit, can you tell us, reveal some of these secrets? Well, we know it's an empress, right? A mother, something. Child's mom, baby mom, somebody. Or somebody that they have the children with, if you're a man, right? So you, you're feeling strong. They see you. You standing in your strength. You're doing what you need to do. You're moving on in your life. Yeah, I don't think you're going to allow this past person back in. And I think they know this. That's why they they can't sleep. You could have new beginnings coming in. Ace of Wands. And this is their L. Maybe they just feel like, like you have these new beginnings and they just don't have a chance anymore. They just won't have a chance anymore. Yeah, see, this person had too many options. They had too many options. And now they said, now they boohooing. 
They feel guilt because they have a person over here. They think you're moving on. You probably are, right? How do we get here, Spirit, with this person here, right? How do we get this far? And it's like now they realize who you are. Now they realize and they love you, right? Actually, you know what? Because there is another person here. Hold up. Wait a minute, guys. I'm up for a reason. I'm up and I'm up and I'm up and I'm up. And when I'm done, I'm going to go and lay back down. But I am up for a reason. Guys, let's talk to the other person, right? Because there is an empress here. Upside down empress. Yeah, they're not very hopeful, this person. Whoever you're dealing with. They were dealing with a lot of burdens. Dealing with you, dealing with other people. All right. Empress said, I'm only around because we have children. I told, you, I told you that was a baby's mama. Anything else there, friends? She said, or they said, it could be a man, they have children together. They have mis mis mismatched behaviors and expectations. They said, why do we love people like them? We should both walk away from them. Mm. So this person went out here and just created burdens for themselves with you with other people, with their child's mother or whoever, right? I found out about you a while ago. I was hoping he would change and leave you alone. So this person, mother, baby, child's mom, whatever the hell we want to call her today, them, hey, whoever, they knew about you. They was just like a lot of women do or like a lot of people do that's really in love. I'm not saying that they turn a blind eye, but it's like I heard about you, but... They believed in their person, that their person was going to leave you alone, right? Yep, they believed in their person, and their person didn't. And see, that's that thing I tell you when I say, guys, give them the rope. I give everybody in any relationship with me. They don't know this. This is friends, family, foe, man, whatever. In the initial part of our relationship, in my mind, I give you a rope and an empty box. And guys, I've been going with this metaphor for years. And basically, they don't know this, but a lot of people that know me today, they know this. They know about me and my rope, and they know about me and my box. And when I say that, it's real. And basically what I say is when I get into a relationship, you know how they say trust is earned, it's not given, blah, 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 blah. I'm there. However, mine's a little different. What I do is mentally, I hand them this box and I hand them a rope. The rope is, I'll never chase, I'll never look, I'll never wonder, I'll never da 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 I'm not going to go through your phone. I don't have that much time. And even if I did, I don't have that much time, right? So what I do is, because truth is always revealed, whatever is done in the dark will come to the light. If you are a liar, you got to be a hell of a liar. You have to be a consistent liar to stay on top of your lying game, right? So what you do is you give them the rope and the box, and then you back up. And you allow a person to be who they are with you. You allow a person to show you who they are. You allow a person to either love you or not love you. You allow this. You allow them, go with me, to hang themselves. Because each time they fuck up, they get a little tired, a little tired, a little tired, and start dripping, right? So give them the rope. And then eventually when you're at your end and you will get your end, just slide that box up under their feet. And then you're done. They hung themselves, box that shit up, you're done. That's my metaphor. It really is. Anybody that comes into my life, you don't know it, but mentally I handed you a box and a fucking rope. Because usually people that either enter or exit my life, I'm not the one that fuck up. They are. It's like they start the fuck up first and then I wrap the fuck up up. And then when I wrap it up, they think, you crazy. No, you crazy. You crazy because you challenged me. You crazy because you thought you can get that shit off. And you crazy because you thought I didn't know. But that's just me. And a lot of other yous. Because I know it. I know it is. I know it. I know it is. Ain't nobody playing this game. You may not hand them a box, but trust me, baby. You handed them something. 
And then you backed up. Hmm. So yeah, this person was, she, they knew about you. They was hoping that this person would leave you alone. And apparently they did. And you probably don't even know about this other person. Dropping cards and things. Spirit shake, spirit shake, calm down. <laughs> Let me grab this card. Got me up at four o'clock in the morning. Hell, this gonna be a hell of a read. Got me up this early, you crazy. What else they want to say? Uh, baby mama said they friends for benefits. So they fuck often. They fuck whenever they need to. How often? Whenever. I'm horny, you horny. I'm horny, you horny. You want breakfast? No, I'm out. I just saw one five, five, five. Guys, make the change. And if you are the baby's mama or the baby daddy with friends for benefit, you need to stop that shit too. That shit ain't cute. Since when? Just because that's your baby daddy or your baby mama, you get to go back and you fuck it from time to time? No. No. You think you're the only one they fucking? <laughs> I'll wait. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Stop being dumb. Stop being dumb. What else? I would love to talk to you or meet you one day. I need answers. Baby mama, baby daddy want to talk to you. They want to talk to you. They would love to meet you one day. You know what? Not twice, Tabitha. Not twice. I have wine. Let's talk. Shit. I would love to talk. If I ever had that problem, I would love to talk to the other person. Because for one, I'm not going to fight the other person. I'm not going to fight you unless you, you get in my face, right? And then that's not even a fight. It's just me defending myself. But if another person could come to me and we can sit down like women and we can talk, And da, 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 do it. Do it. Have that conversation. Because that's the only way you're going to get your truth. And that's the only way they're going to get their truth. Busting and fighting over what Tyrone said, what Daphne said. Daphne loves me. Tyrone loves me. No, he don't. He loves me. He gave me a cake. She gave me a jacket. I don't know. She bought me some boots. Da, 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 boo, 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 boo. That's the game. That's the game. If the two of you can honestly come together and talk to each other and speak your truth, that is how you'll get answers. And then you'll make this fool look like the fool that they are. This is somebody's message. Spirit got me up. Spirit told me to go with it. Let's go. Y'all up? We up. We up now. Shit, I probably want to go back to sleep. God dog it. Oh, that means I'm going to have to take a nap in the afternoon. Holy Spirit, holy angels. Acceptance, huh? So this person here, this lack of a king that can't sleep at night, that likes to cheat on people, and you know, they they're learning to accept the things they cannot change. And I don't know. I don't know. They're gonna try to push through, guys. They, they believe they can persevere. They, they can put their mind to whatever they, they can do, whatever they set their mind to. Let's hope it's <laughs> in adversity. I accept that challenges are the best way to learn. So in the middle of adversity, in the middle of what's going on, because they know they're getting an adverse reaction from you, from their baby's mother, from everybody. So this person, they're getting an adverse reaction. They can't sleep. And they're going to try to accept these challenges. To them, these are challenges, right? They just don't know how. This person was a fuck up. They were. They are. They were, they are. Tell us more about this person's spirit. That's a lot of cards. Wait a minute. Spirit, how did we get here, right? Guys, I put out karma tales too. Karma tales two and three apparently they're mixed in. They were supposed to come out real. So this person, I told you they had somebody, guys, and they do comparisons. They compare you 
and the child's mama together. Either that or the child's mother has been doing comparisons. Either or. Yeah, another woman. So the woman, <laughs> or they're comparing you, they're comparing you against another woman. There's no comparison, sir. There's no comparison, ma'am. Whoever this is, there's no comparison. There's no two people that will ever be the same. They're not. Their energies are different. So it's you. It's who are you? It, it's who are you? Because these two women, three women, four women, five women, they're all different. But who are you? Do you switch hats every time a different motherfucker come through? Like, who are you? You the one that's different. Because every time you get with a different energy, your energy changes too. So who are you? Don't compare these women. It starts with you. Who the fuck are you? Right? Somebody woke me up, guys. Lord have mercy. I ain't done this in a minute. I ain't done this in a minute. Who the hell are you? Who the hell is this person? This person, they read tarot. Either that they read tarot or they went to see a tarot reader. All right? Okay. You know what I mean? What does he tell me? You went to see a tarot reader. You read tarot. You went to see a tarot reader. And the reader said, what do they get from this tarot reader? Guys, they're either a tarot reader, they either have a reading gun, or they have a deck, right? So spirit, whenever these cards was touched in this reading, whether the reading was paid for or pulled by themselves, spirit. What was revealed in this child reading? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What was revealed in this child reading? Guys, what did your person get out of this child reading, right? Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands. What else did they get out of this tarot reading? Let's find out. No new beginnings. They found out. <laughs> they found out that you found out that they had another person that there's no chance in hell with you. They found out that you found out that they are Knight of Wands and that there's no chance in hell with you. They found out that you found out about the other woman or the baby's mama, wherever you place here. Okay, they found out that you found out. Okay, and that's why this bitch can't sleep. And that's why this person is carrying all these birds. And that's why they feel they chose wrong. Blah, 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 blah. And that's why they got a baby mama over here talking about she been knowing about you. And she would love to talk to you one day. And that they still fucking. They friends with benefits. They fucked and they drink tea, coffee, whatever it is that they do. They drink water. They eat Twizzlers and shit. They fuck. It's real easy for them. Real easy. Real easy. They familiar. They familiar. Yep. Queen of Cups. So, the churl reader said, you love this person. <laughs> you in love with a Pisces is what they told him. You in love with a Pisces, right? Okay. Either that or the person you're dealing with is a Pisces. Go with it. Stay with me, right? Yep. I'm in love with a Pisces. However, churl reader said, you didn't offer this Pisces any love. Not a cups in reverse. You didn't offer them anything. You didn't offer them anything. King of Wands in reverse. You didn't offer them anything. What else happened here, Spirit? Mm -mm -mm. What else did the child reader say? Yeah, child reader said you went into this person's life. You didn't offer them anything. Shit was unbalanced. You a nasty ass. And they found out about your sneaky shit. They did. They found out that you a liar, sneaker, trying to come alive. <laughs> Yep, they found out that you were sneaky as you're a liar. So, tell a reader reveal to your person that you know they fucked up. That you know that they are a knight of wands. That you, you know they fucked up. Like a, a fucked up energy. We still here? Y'all still with me? Because this person is a damn fool. You's a fool, you a fool, you a fool, you a fool. They feel guilty, all of that.
What else is going on here, Spirit? Something woke me up. Yeah. This is, uh, they deal with toxic friends and family. They're going to be dealing with things at home. They're also wearing a mask. So it's like their family environment is messed up, guys. And that's probably why they're toxic to you because their family environment is toxic. So this person isn't even who they say they are when they are around you. They wear masquerades. They wear a mask. They fake. This person could be phony. Like, you don't know who this person is. You don't know what they wear from day to day. It's a mask every day. It's a different mask every day. Hold up. I got to sneeze. That was good. All right, bless me. Bless you, girl. Thank you. Yeah, this person's carrying burdens, carrying a lot of issues, carrying a lot of everything. What else is going on here that you need to see? Holy Spirit. Oh, it's a pig. Beware of greed. This person could be a pig, guys. This person could be coming in because um, they think you got money. Firecracker, excitement. You got, oh, this is definitely some excitement. This is definitely some excitement. And Spirit wants you to get back to basics. It woke me up just to tell you to take your ass back to sleep. But this person here ain't worth it, right? You have a teapot, a deep friendship with someone of the same sex. Oh, your person got a deep. Oh. So your person could have a deep friendship with someone of the same sex. And then the month September came out. Maybe they did something in September. Maybe their birthday in September. Oh, maybe it happened in September. I don't know. <laughs> Wait a minute. I know another card dropped. Where did it go? I don't know where it went. Oh, no. Oh, did I get it? I think I got it. All right. One more teapot spirit. So somebody's person may be sleeping with somebody the same sex. Oh, no. No, 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 no. It could be a deep friendship. A deep friendship. That don't mean a sex. It could be a deep friendship with somebody else. Okay. One more spirit. Ooh, two more. We got unicorn. Use your intuition to make beneficial changes. And then we have a boat. So money or property is going to... You're going to get a windfall of money. Somebody's going to get some money. That came out the other day. All right, Holy Spirit. So the person that you're dealing with, what are they hoping to come out of this, you know, with all these burdens that they're carrying? Sure, what can be the outcome here? Because they got a few things going on. They guilty, the baby mama here, everybody. What is going to be the outcome here, Spirit? What do they expect? They're going to offer you love? They still want you. They still want you with this deception. So I guess this cup of love is going to come in with some deception. You're gonna have a decision to make. Or you're gonna you you're making a decision. Yeah, I think you're gonna stop either giving to this connection. It's the chariot in reverse. Like you just you just gonna stop. Yeah. This is not your wish fulfillment. This is not your wish fulfillment. And you're not gonna lose any sleep over it. Period. Amen. That's your wrap up. Spirit said it. <laughs> You will not lose any sleep over this. Spirit told me to go back to bed. I can't now. Spirit, now I'm up. So you're not a hangman anymore about this person and you're moving on. Yep. You learned all you needed to learn about this person. You've been a hermit long enough and you're still a loving person. You're still that queen of cups, that loving person that came out up there, I think, somewhere in another day. Yeah, this person didn't fulfill you emotionally. They couldn't fulfill you emotionally. Baby mama known about you for a minute. She just thought she believed in this person. So they thought this person was going to leave. Whether you are the baby's mama or in reverse or whether you are the guy with the baby's mama or in reverse, right? It could go. Y'all know this is everybody's reading. So it could be a man with a woman, woman with a man, man cheating, woman cheating, da 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 Or you're the man, blah, 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 and your woman fucks up, right? All right. 
And so that's that. And that's why I'm up. So your person can't sleep. And that's why I'm up. They can't sleep because they'll fuck up. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.